Well, here's a question. Now, technically, it's not HD. Heron's pretty excited about it. Mobile ATSC is finally getting useful. Yes. The announcements are that by this spring, Washington, D.C. will be the first market to receive what they call ATSC Mobile. It's, a, it's that digital over-the-air standard. They've tweaked it so that you can use it in a mobile environment. Current ATSC, like you would use your digital television reception, you can't move that around. The antenna has to stay fixed. It's prone to things like multi-path interference, where if you have signals bouncing off of buildings and things like that, things can get messed up. Also, if you're moving with an antenna with the current ATSC system, you have Doppler effect that can mess up the signal as well. This helps add layers of error correction that deal with all of that. Vizio announced three portable devices ranging in price uh, up to a 10-inch screen. I believe it's 8-inch to 10-inch, 7-inch to 10-inch screens in under $200. Wow. For, as well as Samsung introduced a mobile phone with support with a single chip ATSC M solution as well. That'll be out hopefully in time for the spring. But currently it's just the Washington DC market will be the test run. Mm -hmm. There's also a question as to if this content, in the spec it says they can lock it in terms of protecting it. It should be free to air. It, it, that's it what my, in my humble opinion. Will it be? We're going to have to wait and see if they decide to was, make it a premium service. I was sitting there and I'm like, who would buy this? And you made the point. It's like, this is the television you carry to the baseball game to watch the baseball game while totally. you're watching the baseball game. One of the top selling TVs on, on Amazon.com right now is a 7-inch portable right. ATSC television. And, you know, if they can make these truly mobile where you can keep it in the car is really where they're looking for. Or you're on the train or whatever, on your mobile device where you're moving around. That's where they want to be able to maintain that signal quality and provide provide free to air, hopefully free to air digital content to your portable device. That would be pretty cool.